Hi, I'm Raj. Thanks for Goldcase to give us opportunity to show our business proposal. <laughs> Basically, I'm, I have my proposal for recycling computer parts. Those uh, we can import second-hand product from Europe, US, and bring it to Singapore in lower price. You can see there is a use computer parts we bring to Singapore and we can test those computer parts is good. We can recon and we can sell again. Those computer is not working. Just example for desktop, laptop, not working. We can dismantle it or we try to repair it and we can recondition and can sell again. And those good parts we can fix to the second hand casing and we make the good computer and we can sell to developing country. Or those parts is already defective, we try to repair it. If we make it get repair, we can resell again. Otherwise, we can sell as a scrap. It. Scrap price also we can get because we are getting from Europe is very lower price. You can see that there is a, some of the bad parts and we can sell the rec, uh, scrap. And those good parts we can re-export again. This is the stuff, what kind of product we can import from overseas market, mainly from Europe and USA. And currently we are buying but very small scale. Okay, this, uh, this item, what uh, inside the PC we are finding, like uh, this is a motherboard, this is a power supply, this is a DVD ROM, hard disk, uh, video card, heatsink and processor. Hard disk, okay, maybe CPU defective. So those items, good item, we can take out from the PC and we can use in new PC another PC, so we can make it one complete good uh, computer. But we need some, some space, some of the fund we required for machine, testing, warehouse, testing team. Finally, we can <laughs> make million dollars for this. All right, I like the spirit, Raj. Thank you. All right, contestants, we've saved the best for last. And I want to know your opinions. Siti? Dreamer. 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 Four dreamers, wow, wonderful. And judges, what do you think? Mr. Raj, you are doing this business for almost five years. Yes. Uh, how many people are doing almost the same business in Singapore? 30 people, 30 to 40 people. Are they very successful in that? Some are the people very successful. Some are, they have different working style. Actually, I did you know, forget to mention, I have one plan to insert, a, like we have to create some OJT program to ITE Singapore. So same time, I can get some work from them and they, they can get some recognition. I can, my company also can get some recognition from the Singapore. How long is the cash flow cycle like from the day you buy and the day you sell? How long is the cycle? If we take the stock, it depends if need to be recycled or we have to retest or we have to resell as it is. There's two, two kind of product, like we import from buy, we can see the condition, we can resell it. Then we can offer to the my customer. If they're willing to buy as it is, and we will calculate how much profit margin I'm getting, so I will sell it. Otherwise, if you think I can recon and we can repair and can get the more profit margin, then I will do that. If you have the manpower and the budget, mm -hmm. is it an area that you are more interested in or are you still actually more interested in doing a trading business more than a... Actually, uh, my main aim to set up the workshop and test it and then resell it. So folks, I hope you've enjoyed this inspiring episode. I guess we've learned that when the going gets tough, only the tough get going. I'm GK Sanghar and I'll see you here, same time, same place, at Goldkist My First Million.